What's up, everybody? It come here, y'all. I want to talk about some shit real quick. I want to talk about some shit about rap niggas, bro. Let me get this out of my face. I just woke up my bad. I want to talk about rap niggas real quick. I feel like my bad. I feel like it's real lame. I feel like rap niggas do shit real lame shit. Let me explain it. Us as rap niggas, right? It's just on my mind, so I went live. I want to talk about this shit. Us as rap niggas with all this power, right? First off, I want to tell you, it's a lot. All, all these big rappers, bro. And I'm going to speak to, I'm talking to like local rappers, like niggas want to come up. All these big rappers, bro, they watching y'all niggas. Like, they fuck with all y'all shit. They playing your music in their house with their homeboys. They, they, they love your shit. All these big rap niggas, these ones y'all idol, idolize, they fucking love. All you niggas coming up music. But I feel like it's lame as fuck because rap niggas will never tell you, bro. A nigga will never tell you a nigga want to come up like, yo, little bro, your shit fire. Like, and I feel like that's lame as fuck because like these kids, some of these kids ain't got no money. You know what I'm saying? Ain't got nothing. They feel like nothing's working. I mean, you got motivation, bro. And you, your rich ass is blaming that shit. All day with your homies, but you a bum ass nigga, you lame, and you let your your mentality get the best of you, you won't tell them. That could be the only thing the little nigga need to keep rapping, bro. I'm not even saying little nigga, because I'm not trying to belittle nobody, because you could be older than me, you could be bigger than me, but you can even be a better rapper than me, so I'm not trying to say little nigga, I'm not trying to like belittle anybody, but I'm just saying like, as a rap nigga, bro, as somebody with a higher power, bro, we got to be the ones to, like... Because I know, like, I know a lot of niggas try to say, I be riding niggas' ways, but, bro, I'm a fucking millionaire, bro. I ain't riding nobody way, bro. I like to tell niggas, like, yo, your shit is fire, bro. Like, I like to tell a young nigga, yo, bro, yo, you going crazy, bro. Nigga asked me doing this remix if I like it. Fuck, I'm going to do it, bro. I don't... I'm not going to, like... I'm at the, I'm not going to have the mentality, mentality that, like... Whoa, this nigga shit so hard. But then never say some shit. Then a nigga die. And then go. I go up and be like, damn, this nigga was so talented. I love this nigga. Like, I, I was such a fan of this nigga. Like, like, well, not even if a nigga die. Because I'll be ex, We're not even talking about X right now. We're not talking about nothing X related right now. I'll be X. But say a nigga blow up. And you been doing about the nigga music, bro, but... Oh, shit, what's up, Jay? But you so lame, bro. You won't talk about, like, you you wouldn't tell the nigga until he blow up. That's lame shit, bro. Like, you really, like, and you been new about the nigga, bro. You ain't got it. It's not even so much as, like, posting and promoting a nigga. Like, because it's, I understand, like, some rappers don't want to give free clout or whatever you want to call it. But it's as far as telling a nigga, liking a nigga picture or a video or commenting on, on, on and damn the nigga and just letting the nigga know, yo, bro, yeah, you got talent, bro. Keep at it. Yo, bro, your music fire, bro. Keep at that shit, bro. Uh, I see you. I see you. I see you, bro. I'm fucking with that. Like, I don't, I don't know why niggas feel like they too, they too good for that shit. Like, niggas feel like they too cool to do some shit like that. I just feel like rappers, bro, we got to, we got to support the up and, because nigga, nobody, none of us came in the game but as an on rapper, everybody had to grow. Everybody had to hustle. Everybody had to, like, grind. I... Honeycomb brought back the original flavor. Amazing. But, um, every rapper had to grow. No rapper just came in the game on. Like, just jumped in the game and was on. So I feel like that shit lame, bro. Like, if you a rap nigga, man, you know young niggas look up to you, bro. Like, you genuinely know young niggas, they like, not, not even if you know, bro, it's just in general, even if they don't even like your fucking music, bro, I don't care if you don't like my shit, I'm still gonna tell you, bro, you're talented, bro, or, 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 bro, you on, you on to something, bro, I just feel like all rappers need to get into that, bro, cause, like, I don't know, bro, that could be the last thing to motivate a nigga to keep going, you never know what a nigga got going on, bro, that's just how I was feeling, so I got online and spoke about it, whatever, yo, we still doing this XXX thing, um, the candlelight, if you're in Atlanta, um, it was raining. I think it's, it stopped um, where I'm at. I'm in Sandy Springs. But we're going to Centennial. 
9 o'clock, push back to 9 o'clock. I want to see everyone there. Uh, bring the speakers, you know what I'm saying? Bring everything. We're we going up. We're going to have a peaceful, good time, man, in remembrance of X, man, the good dude, the legend. So, that's all I want to say. That's how I was feeling. I appreciate y'all for listening. I'm out. Love y'all, niggas. Holla.